Today, we'll focus on a topic that is often overlooked and underestimated when it comes to discussions about health tetanus. Though considered a rare disease, tetanus still poses a real threat to our well-being. In this episode, we'll take a closer look at this condition, its symptoms, causes, and prevention methods. Tetanus, also known as lockjaw, is caused by the bacterium Clostridium tetani. This bacterium is present in soil, everyday objects, and the natural environment. Tetanus infection can occur through wounds or contamination of a wound with soil, dust, or animal feces. The symptoms of tetanus often include muscle stiffness, spasms, particularly in the jaw and neck, difficulty swallowing, and breathing problems. In severe cases, tetanus can lead to complications such as organ damage and even death. Prevention is key when it comes to tetanus. The most effective method is vaccination. Ensuring that you receive regular tetanus vaccinations can significantly reduce the risk of infection. Additionally, maintaining proper wound care is crucial, especially for injuries that may be exposed to contaminated materials. Tetanus vaccinations are widely available and typically administered as part of routine immunization schedules. These vaccines stimulate the production of antibodies that provide immunity against the tetanus toxin. It's important to keep your vaccinations up to date to ensure ongoing protection. In addition to vaccinations, there are resources available to help you stay informed about your health. One such resource is the home test provided by Berkeley Health. Tetanus home test allows individuals to check their immunity levels against tetanus. This can be particularly useful if you're unsure about your vaccination history or if you've experienced a potential exposure to tetanus, 